Buongiorno, I'm Elior Sara. I born in a small village called Cetraro, is in south of Italy in Calabria. And uh, my inspiration about the restaurant business was given from my grandmother. She was an amazing woman. She had 13 children, but the most special thing was that she had their own locanda and was treating the customer like his own child. I never see a menu in my grandmother restaurant and she was going, each customer say, oh, you should eat this, you should eat that. I know that in modern time it's not uh, possible to do this, but uh, what I most learned from, from her was to take care of people one by one and give the best for what you have. When I had to choose my ingredient, what we do is we create our section, very Italia, and I went to Italy, not in a big production or big company, I went to the farmer, the farmer that guaranteed me the food that I grew up with. I went ingredient by ingredient to farmer, to people that produce, these things we bring from Calabria, the most remote area in Calabria, and we bring in Japan. You bring in Japan, you can eat here. You can buy our product in very Italia. This is, and I guarantee personally, that this for you will be the price and the goods, the best deal of your life. And this is very important because in my children, I have two children, I give you this stuff like my grandmother used to give to their own children. Nowadays you have this very expensive wine that very few people can afford. Personally, I want a really good wine for a really reasonable price. That's why the reason I go to import the wine, I talk with the winemaker. I go there, I find the wine, I bring it to Japan, for the price, reasonable price, and the taste has to be good. And I love the grape to be original from the place. That's very important. Nowadays you have a Cabernet Sauvignon from Chile, from Australia, from America, from Italy, from France. It's globalization. I am Italian, I am from south of Italy. I want you to try my wine because I am very proud of my Calabrian wine. Viva la Calabria! 21 years ago, nobody really know what was Japan because it sounds so far away. But the great thing is, I like people and I was curious about Japan. So 21 years ago, I came in this country and I was a first love. What I want to do in Japan is combine the good thing about Italians with the beautiful culture of Japan. And uh, so many people, so many friends of mine ask, you know, this is Japan, you have to do for Japanese taste. I don't believe in that. If something is good, you have to do whatever your culture gives to you. I think that the mix doesn't apply to me. My food is simple, is original. I try to get my ingredient for the best. And Italian food is good. Today you can eat uh, a pasta everywhere. You can buy a pasta for 200 yen or for 2,000 yen or for 20,000 yen. What is the difference? What is the difference is this. The presentation, this and that. But for me, what makes the difference who makes this pasta? What are the ingredients to make this pasta? What is the culture background of people that make this pasta? And not so expensive. I am so happy that people appreciate that we take care of them. And that is very, very important. I have a team that is waiting and work to, for you to get the best. 
take care of your food. Because our, my grandmother used to say, what you eat is what you are. Ciao.